What's poppin' everybody? Welcome back. I'm gonna teach you how to do my shakes, basically. It's very simple, you don't need any fucking plugins, none of that bullshit, so let's get started on it. Grab your clips, twixter them, do whatever, on beat, of course. I've got these right here. You can see. Okay, so, grab an adjustment clip from the effects tab. Go to toolbox, search adjustment clip. Okay, so make it as long as the video. Boom, jump into Fusion with it. Open in Fusion page or I have bind it to F. Make sure you do that, okay? Boom, jump in Fusion. Click, shift space, camera, shake. Grab the one without the whatever the fuck that is. So, go to the beginning. Motion scale, right click. Modify with Anim Curves. Jump to Modifiers. We're gonna click source duration, curve to custom. The first point you're gonna make it be two. And then the second one, you're gonna type at the out zero. Boom. Now we're gonna modify the curve. Press control A, drag this however you want, however fast or sharp you want. I just want it like this. Pretty sharp, not too shabby. Now we're gonna go to tools. Speed scale all the way. Motion blur, depends on how you like it. Okay, so these are the settings. This is X, this is Y, this is rotation, this is how fast it is. PTR speed, zoom amplitude is Z shake. It's Z, you have to modify the speed as well. Right here, I'm gonna do a bit of a Z. Boom, some amplitude, outward and inward. I'm gonna have, I want tilt on this, I want Y shake. I want it to end faster, so I'm gonna do 1.5 on the scale. Like so. On the border type, make sure you have reflect. Always do that. Boom, so that's it. You can play around with these right here. Randomness, whatever the, the fuck this is. I never cared for that, honestly. So now you've got a shape. Boom. You can throw this in your power bins and this will adjust automatically to however long your clips are basically now let's do it for the impact so for the impact i'm gonna alt click it and drag it here it's basically the same thing all i want to do is modify a bit on the pan the tilt and make it stronger so i'm gonna do four on the scale see how it looks lasts for way too long so I'm gonna do time scale 1.5 I think that's how it looks without it here's without here's with it I think it looks decent man you can go crazier like 7 on 1.5 1.75 I'm gonna go with tilt a bit more. That's it. So here's my shake. I use this basically in all of my edits. This is the most prominent one I use. That's it. Peace.